I am sure that you've heard of the saying, all good things come to an end. And that is a true statement. All good things come to an end. I truly believe that. This video is completely different than what you're used to seeing because I'm going to share with you a private side of my personal life, my, my hobbies. I have a lot of hobbies and I'm going to upload the video. By the time you're seeing this, it's going to be followed up with another video, but there's going to be 30 days apart from when they're filmed. And when I say all things come to an end, I've been a collector ever since I was a little boy. I started off collecting baseball cards, collecting coins from around the world, just collecting things, eventually cassettes for music in the 1980s. I just love collecting things. I've always liked to collect things. And what I'm gonna share with you is right back there, that is my jersey collection for the Los Angeles Lakers. I started in 2005. We were stationed in Hawaii, and the first jersey that I bought, Los Angeles Lakers, was a Kobe Bryant jersey. I bought it on eBay, and I bought it used, and it's still in there. I have approximately 100 Lakers jerseys. Now, people are gonna say, why do you have 100? And the answer, simply put, is I'm a collector. That was 17 years ago when I first got my first one and then I started adding more and more and more. And I would specialize on the rare pieces. But it, the time has come now where they just sit there, take up space. That's it, I don't even wear them. But it's time to let go of at least 75 of them. And what I want to do is I've given myself a 30 day period starting today where I've posted them on eBay for sale. And I'm gonna sell, my goal is to have, get rid of 75, but my goal is to have at least 30 sold in the next 30 days. And that's gonna be followed up with a second video back to back, but it's gonna be 30 days apart, like I said. And I'm gonna share with you on how many I got rid of because as a collector, and I have a lot of collections of things, it just takes up space. And there's different chapters in life. And my next chapter is, I'm done with them. With the exception of about maybe 20 or 25 that I'll keep. And the crazy thing about this is that I have about 18 of them that are game worn. I'm not selling those, at least to start off. And Maybe down the road I will, but maybe I won't. I'm not starting with those. So I'm gonna st share with you how much I earn after fees and the IRS will get their 20% as well. But the first one ships out tonight. They've already paid for it. I've made one sale. I have currently on eBay, not by the time you watch this, but I have 12 of them that have bids that will end in the next three, four or five days. And I'm adding more and more and more constantly over the next 30 days. And like I said, the reason is I'm just cashing out. It's, they just sit there, it's time to move on. And uh, I'll keep you posted, but let me share with you this. So from right around here, all of that, they just sit there. Great pieces. They take up space. It's time to go on. Then I have my stuff that I wear. These are just vintage Dodger shirts that I don't wear. It's time to move on and have them move on because then I have another closet here. And these are my rock and roll shirts. And some of those are going to go as well. But of course, the video is about that stuff right there. Then I have jackets that I have. Then I have baseball jerseys that I have. These I'm going to keep. I want to share that with you. These videos are going to be back to back 30 days apart. Let's see how much I can get rid of and how much that goes for.